Hey Queens, welcome back to my channel. This is your girl Inga Hair. Okay, if you're new here, just go ahead and hit the subscribe button. We would love to have you a part of this Queens Nation. So welcome again guys. I am going to be doing a try on of my matte lip liquid lipsticks. Um, I have these in a variety of colors and I guess some of you guys should know that by now, but yeah. So the colors that I have in these are Royalty Liberty, Pink Sand, Sea Grape, Carl Harbor, Mauve, and uh, it's another one I cannot remember. I also have these lashes that I am pimping right now at the shop. So what I'm going to be using for one or two of them is this MAC lip liner. I think it's in Chestnut. And this is so important. I am using my lip balm. Um, it's for moisturizing the lips because you know with the matte lip liquids your lips can get extremely extremely dry So what I'm going to be using here is the sea grape. This is the first lip liquid that I'm using It's a purplish pinkish color. It's showing more pink because my lighting here is so bright So what I do is this is my outline that I usually do for my matte lip liquids especially um, because I don't want to overline my lips with this type of um, texture lipstick because matte with matte lip liquids the overline lips kind of look sort of sloppy I think you can get away with it with other lipsticks but you don't want to overline your lips with this so this is a creamy smooth texture lip liquid also I think that they all are and these are this color is a one of my favorite colors and I named this color sea grape so you can also go and shop this at the shop and what I wanted to say is these are buy one get one half off if you um, are able to go and visit our site okay so I have another one of my favorite lip liquids and this is Bahama Mama. You cannot see the writing clearly because of the bright light. I think I had um, the lighting too bright right here. And yeah, so I'm just going to pat that right now and then do the three outlines. And as you can see guys, my lips are extremely small and thin so... Um, a person with larger lips will have it easier putting these matte lip liquids on and as you can see I what I do with the top is I go around the cupid's brow and just bring it back into the other side um, that is much easier if you try to apply your lip liquids like this I don't like I said I don't want to overline them because it looks a bit messy so that's why I do the outline so yeah I really love this color it's a nice juicy red as you can see it's jubilant and it's a very vibrant so just finishing off with the red right here I tell you I really love the red lipstick it's really really nice so I must tell you these are running very low I have a few in each of them so if you want to get your hands on any of these you gotta go and hurry up and grab them okay so I will have um, everything listed in the description box below the website will be going across from time to time so you guys will have it easier to just go and click on and you will enter into the shop just like that so this is a more natural like um, shade it's mauve a lot of people love this and I think it's just a few of these left and this is um, where I'm gonna line my lips first I'm gonna do like two versions of this for you guys I'm gonna do a matte version and then I'm gonna show you a version where I put the gloss um, on top of the matte lip liquid so yeah I am lining my lips with the chestnut by MAC and it comes out absolutely gorgeous I said this is mauve rather instead of mauve it's mauve and yes you can go and shop this also this um, version of it gave it a more ombre type look 
and I love it yeah so I'm just gonna go back and forth doing this um, so I can get that desired look So I hope you guys enjoyed this look. So this is the other look that I told you guys about. And this is the gloss that I'm using. This is Purity. I am sold out of this, unfortunately. But this is another look that you can use the Morvi with or the more natural lipids with. So yeah, I'm excited about this next color. It's Royalty. I have never worn a purple before, but a lot of people are crazy about it i was very surprised i just wanted to step out of the box and just not get the ordinary colors of lip um lipsticks so i went and i got this and it's called royalty and i am telling you guys it is a very royal it is very purple so yeah and you have to be very careful when you line your lips with this you don't want to overline it and look make it look messy but Overall, it comes out absolutely gorgeous, and I think I'm going to be wearing this color as of now. And oh my god, I have something exciting for you. This is pink sand and it's like a hottish pinkish like. So um, if you're very bold and daring or oh, what you can do with this also is add the gloss to it and it tones it right down. So yeah, as you can see that you, um, I showed you the applicator that I didn't show you earlier, but the applicator is very nice and it, it, it's not short. So you don't have that problem of um, missing anything. I think that's why it glides on so well because of the length of the applicator. Yeah. So yes, my dears, I am also using as a shadow from my original Queen's palette. Um, those are some of the colors that I am wearing right now. And as you can see, they apply smoothly and creamy. So yeah, you can go check that out also. And here you have it, guys. It's a nice, gorgeous pink. I love it. And also, if you're interested, the braids that I'm wearing right now, these are from a, like a crochet package and they come in like long strips in the package. I think these were the, um, I wouldn't say, but those are crochet box braids if you're interested. And I know someone will, someone will be asking me, so I'm just letting you know now. So here I have here another one, and this is the Coral Harbor. And this is more of an orange type. This one here is very creamy also, although most of them have the same texture like but for some reason this one is very very creamy and it came on it came off nicely i really really liked it so i'm just gonna finish applying this and as you can see we're winding down right now because i have a few more left to go and if you see me with this black pencil above my Cupid's bow. I'm just aligning that with some of the gold and that is the gold highlighter So 
so we actually have one more to do and this is a liberty and this is definitely a liberation of free your mind mindset lip liquid lipstick okay you will definitely feel free with this this is extremely creamy also um, it's a very bold statement yeah but it's not a shocking green or a neon green I should say it's a smooth tone down green um, I've, I've seen a lot of people wear it um, they, they have sent me re reviews on it and it looks absolutely gorgeous um, I have never worn this either but I think I am going to be trying a few of these colors that I have never worn I'm going to step out of the box a little bit yeah so as you can see it goes on very smoothly um, and one thing I said is be sure to moisturize your lip with the lip balm not the lip gloss the lip balm because it doesn't have it too slippery or too wet or too glossy for these um, lip liquids so yeah there you have it so go and shop these lip liquids the BOGO 50 that's the code that you need to use and yeah I'll see you at the shop okay so another thing I have for you guys is how to remove your lip lipstick after you have applied it the matte ones that is and it's simple because a lot of people have problems with them like st sticking to the lips or being too hard to remove but all you have to do is take that same lip balm and just gently remove it and you can apply it as um, you see fit and just take a cloth or your napkin or a makeup wipe and just look at that remove it gently and it's clean again okay so that's how you do that and afterwards you can just go and apply your favorite lip moisturizer onto your lips because of all the um, harshness that I have been through just a while ago with applying those different lipsticks on I'm just gonna gloss my lips right now and I'm also gonna be swatching for you guys mind your business I don't think I did a swatch with that one but before we go ahead and do that I just wanted to mention yeah the giveaway it's about to go down now and I have this gorgeous makeup bag for you guys in the giveaway there it is and I have the, these two high gloss for you one is um, bold gold and one is mind your business so the rules are you have to be a subscriber on YouTube like these videos you can share it if you want to but you have to follow me on Instagram and when you go to Instagram that is when you will tell me that you came from YouTube and then you will be eligible to enter into the giveaway this here is the mind your business that I was telling you guys about and it's absolutely gorgeous I love it and like I said the lighting is so bright um, next time I'm gonna have to fix that problem but yeah as you can see who <laughs> I love it yes okay so you can go and shop this I think this is at my Etsy shop okay and these are monthly giveaways so it will end the same time in April uh, which is the 25th so I will see you guys in my next video and I hope you guys enjoyed the lip swatches and yeah go and shop these don't forget bye bye